come back to Imperial to meet up again with Dr. Carl LaRue. Having convinced me that hormones shape our appetite, he now believes that one particular kind of surgery can fundamentally change the levels of these hormones. Surgery on the stomach, what's called a gastric bypass. Can you just explain to me the mechanics of gastric bypass surgery? So let me explain it like this. That's the esophagus or the gullet. That is the stomach. That is the small bowel and that is the large bowel. So what the surgeons do is they cut the stomach and they cut the small bowel. So you're now left with your esophagus normal. You have now a small stomach. So your stomach goes from the size of your two fists into the size of your thumb. The rest of the stomach remains in place and the first 50 centimeters of your small bowel. And that's why it's called the stomach bypass because we take the bottom bit of the small bowel and connect it to the small stomach and now it food is bypassing the stomach and the first part of the small bowel. Reducing the size of the stomach obviously limits how much a person can eat, but it has a more unexpected effect too. It also changes the patient's behavior. So what you're saying then is that this particular operation actually seems to affect someone's motivation to eat. That's, that's right. So the patients come to us in clinic and say, doctor, where did the surgeon do the operation? Did they operate in my tummy or did they operate in my head? Because I don't feel hungry anymore. When I do eat, I feel full. And all the changes has really happened in my head. 